Welcome back to Mumble and Shout. Mm -hmm. Hi. What was that you were doing just then? Oh. What was I doing? Yeah. I don't think that's for viewers. That was just a... Uh, I think Whoa. I'm uh, exposing my hipster leanings a little bit too much if I tell the audience what I was doing. Uh, I was uh, singing lyrics from uh, a release by a band called... What? what? Did you just go through that laser? I did. Can you just go through... No, not that time. Oh, well, not uh, all lasers. Exposing flaws. Not all lasers are deadly. <laughs> uh, keep it unpolitical. <laughs> um, yes. Um, oh, shit. How... Uh, have you seen that video of that laser shooting down that plane? What? A plane being shot down by a laser. An actual plane. An actual Are there real life inside? plane. No, no, no. Like, is this like a military test? It's like a military test. Okay. Uh, Go on. To see if the lasers worked. And I shot it and it was like. Just yes. like. It wasn't like yes. a laser beam like you would imagine it. It was just like light. It was like a really strong light hitting it. That is exactly what a laser is. No, no, I mean like a sci fi laser beam. It's not like a sci fi laser beam. Okay. But if they shot it at nighttime, would it look like one? Uh, no, because I don't think you see like the. The path you just see the start and the end. Why don't they dye the the light that shoots out of it? Uh, because that's not how lasers. Uh, I don't know. I've seen lasers and they come in red and green. <laughs> um, but yeah, they they shut it down. It looks really scary. Yeah, that's it's terrifying. So Is it just like easy? it's one shot and then it just the yeah, it takes like two seconds and then just it kind of just like has light on it for a second and then oh shit mm. oh shit. Yesterday afternoon, I spent my day researching um, conspiracy surrounding um, deep underground military bases, uh, which within the conspiracy community is shortened to dumb. Deep, deep underground, underground military, military bases. Right. Um, do they understand how that sounds? Uh, I don't think they do, because they're conspiracy theorists. Right. I don't think they really care about what you sheeple think of their terms. Shit. Would you consider yourself a sheeple, Jake? I would. Yeah. Right. So what? Ah, uh, gas. I'm getting gas. Gas is in the vents, so I'm they're gas. gonna get knocked I'm out. Gas. Do they get knocked out? When did you set off gas from the vents? When I was down the bottom. No, you just set the machine on fire. Yeah, yeah. So it released gas. I thought it was to burn the house down. Yeah, eventually. But I've got to, like, let the gas go throughout the room. You mean smoke? No, gas. Mate. Why? Pay attention. Would setting the air conditioning unit on fire make a gas that makes people pass out? Um, I don't know. I'm not a ninja. Well, neither am I. So we're going to have to call one in. <laughs> do you uh, know, do you uh, know <laughs> any ninjas? I know one. Um... He's very orthodox ninja, though. <laughs> what is an orthodox ninja? He's um, I think he's actually in the neighborhood. Let me give me a give him a give uh, give him a buzz or her. I don't know. Where's a lot of black? Can't really tell. Um, that's an iPhone seven. That's what they're gonna sound like. I got a a, a, a special copy because I'm part of the uh, online uh, media elite. Um, anyway. Uh, sorry, uh, you picked up a while ago, didn't you? And that was super rude. Um, no, I'm recording that, um, you know that really stupid, uh, let's play thing that I do? Yeah, 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 the huge waste of time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, what are you up to? Killing someone? Okay, how long will that take? Oh, shit, you've, you've done it already. Wow, you are good at your job. Um, how'd you do it? What do you mean you made it? You did it with children's craft scissors. I didn't think you could actually kill or even cut anybody with those. No, they're not even good at cutting paper. How did you do that? Okay, ninja trade secrets. I guess you're not allowed to. Um, do you want to talk to Jake? You know, no, no, you know Jake. He, uh, he's the one that looks like uh, if like an onion fucked a meatball and they had a baby and then that baby got run over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Meatball, onion, uh, run over baby. 
Uh, uh, anyway, um, uh, so we got. I'll put you on a uh, loudspeaker. Mm-hmm. Or actually, yep. do you think you could come in? Oh shit! Oh fuck, he's here. Um, he's good. Uh, this is my friend Ninja. Ninja. Just Ninja? Uh, I don't know. I would refer to you as Ninja, but Ninja obviously uh, can't talk. Uh, <laughs> would give away uh, his location. Yeah. Uh, communicates everything through uh, like a, a complex ninja sign language that I'm fluent in. Right. Uh, and we were talking on FaceTime before. That's how. Right. Because that... otherwise, you know, if this was a bit, it wouldn't make sense. But this isn't a bit. It's reality. It's my it's ninja, real friend. Life. It's ninja friend. real life. ninja friend. Real life. Sorry. Yeah, I'm ignoring you. I'm a, being a bad host. So. Um, you got questions for the ninja? Do I? Yes. Oh, the uh, smoke question. How did you get into ninja? How did you get into Ninja? Uh-huh. Um, he says that... Uh, or she. I'm sorry. Um, I like that you're keeping it ambiguous as well. Like, you're correcting me and being like, or she? Um, <laughs> like, they don't know either. They don't know. They're, they're just Ninja. Um, apparently, um, that's all they know. They were, See, you set the building on fire. Do you set a lot of buildings on fire? No, of course you don't. Yeah, it'd be ridiculous for a ninja to set a building on fire. It's the opposite of stealth. Fire is the opposite of stealth. I know! I'm having this argument all the time! God, people won't leave me about it. They're like, why don't you just burn it down? I'm like, because that's the opposite of stealth! Um, anyway. Uh... Uh... What do you mean? How, you, you What? What? How do they get into ninja? How, how did you... How, I'm sorry. I get sidetracked. I, like, um... Uh, do the sign language <laughs> for, the, for the audience. Do the sign language for them. The I don't need ninja. to do the sign language. The ninja's doing the sign language. But how do you speak? So they, they can I understand. understand. They can sign understand. Language. They can hear me. Right. Okay. Because they need to like gather intel. Right. So obviously he or she can hear me and understand right, me. Right. 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 Do you speak uh, every language, even Aramaic? No one even speaks that. Wow. Um, but you don't speak any of those languages. No, just the ninja hand language. Um, to answer your question, ninja says, uh, that this sounds like a racist Confucius say, uh, set up. Uh, (laughs) ninja says, um, that just born into it. Like that's all they've ever known. So the family business. Not a family. Uh, right. A loose collection of people business. Like, uh, their first memory is waking up where? In the snow-covered woods of Japan. And there was an elderly ninja sitting in a tree. Uh, and they did sign language at Ninja when Ninja was baby. Right. Uh, and... <laughs> is there any kind of school? Uh, no, it's like you survive being alone in the woods right, for survive. the first 20 years of your life. Right. You ninja. Right. Okay. So like raised by wolves kind of situation. Uh, yeah. Raised by... No. Eat, killing and eating wolves with the occasional guidance of an elderly ninja. Ooh. <laughs> um, killing and eating wolves. Is that hard? What kind of... What's a ninja meat like? No, so what's wolf meat like? Is ninja what I'm... meat like. Ooh. Oh. He, she does not like that question. <laughs> At all. Uh, Don't worry. No. Like, I won't eat he, you, ninja. Even, even if Jake wants to eat you, like, <laughs> like he'd be able to take down a ninja. I could, uh, um, okay. You want to challenge ninja? I'll, ta- I'll challenge ninja. Okay. Ninja already has a knife at Jake's throat. That's true. Uh, I'm I'm on the brink of death. Um, He's very calm about it, aren't uh, Yeah, I don't know. I just it's not my first rodeo, you know. I've been. Uh, How many rodeos have you been to? Been act- are you a uh, cowboy? Okay, you asked me the question. Cowboy how- versus ninja. Are you asking me how many? Nin- oh, that's clickbait are you right there. Me how many ninjas? Dot com. How many ninjas I fought? Or how actually how many rodeos I've been to? Because it's quite a few. Uh, both. Uh, how rodeos? many ninjas have you fought at rodeos? <laughs> Strangely, the two never really uh, mix. But you're um, a cowboy. No, but I've been to like five rodeos. Wow. You yeah. really are from the country. I really am. My mom loves rodeos. And uh, so you know, I love my mom. So, you know, if you want to go to rodeo, I'm like, sure, mom. Let's go you to know rodeo. what? Uh, my I mean, mom I was five. Was? So, I mean, okay. You know, yeah. I didn't like recreationally go as an adult. 
You st- ha- he has had the knife pressed to his throat this entire time. Look, I've got a really strong throat. Really unfazed. <laughs> um, I was often wondering why you wear that net guard constantly. Yeah, it's for it's for um the the constant knife to the throat. Yeah, yeah. The the big piece of leather that he has strapped around <laughs> his neck constantly. All Thought it was a fashion thing. And I don't really get fashion, ladies and gentlemen. These people working in Paris and Milan, walking down runways, trying to act like they're better than me. Well, it's all a conspiracy. They're trying to keep down the ugly people. The ugly shall inherit the earth. Check your Bible, people. Um, anyway, uh, you got to go, Ninja? All right, it was lovely seeing you. And are we on for tonight? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Ninja Ristis. Sick ass. (laughs) Um, And you want what? A a rim job? Uh, uh, Yeah, all right. Because you're doing such a great service for our country. Yes, I will rim you, Ninja. All right. Love you. Bye-bye. Aw, that was sweet. What are you guys doing tonight? Uh, Rim jobs and Ristis. Rim jobs and Ristis. That sounds cute. Classic, uh... Uh, right. Wednesday for us. Yeah, it's uh, it's what we do. Oh, Taco sh- Tuesdays, shit. rim job and wristy Wednesdays. Oh shit! A uh, wristy for those of you in an international audience is an Australian slang term for a hand job. A hand jobby. Uh, so called because uh, the hand job was actually invented by one Alan Wrist. <laughs> and has nothing to do with the usage of the actual wrist. Oh, you know what? I hadn't even thought that the wrist and the hand are right near right? each other. They're, they're very... They're, the interplay is, um, is, is there. But it's, we it's, have, just a, it's just a uh, funny coincidence. Um, I actually... Uh, I used to work in a sex shop. Um, and I've got some connections in the industry. And I actually... Um, maybe we'll have him on the show sometime. I have become close friends with uh, Alan Wrist. Alan Wrist, man. He, uh... Not today. Not today. Don't confuse him with Alan Ristman. Uh, who... <laughs> Two completely different people. Mm, definitely this... not. Alan Ristman is a professional Alan Rickman impersonator. Right. Shit. What? You're fucked. Oh, oh shit, mate. what's that? Flair? They, they can do that shit now? Yeah, the big armor dude. Alright, um, sweet. Uh, next time on Rumble and Shout, uh, Jake won't die. He'll definitely beat this level, and it'll be really stealthy and cool, and he'll beat it, and he'll win. Uh, Alright, next time on Rumble and Shout. Bye, babies.